So I started this episode of Subnautica not knowing at all what I was going to do. I wasn't planning on recording for very long, and I ended up recording for a little over an hour. And uh, in the video, I mentioned how I didn't really want to edit that much, and I'm going to stick by that. This is just going to be about an hour of solid, just uncut footage. There's a little bit of cuts. Like, there was one part where I was just on the Seamoth going like a thousand meters, so and I didn't say a word, so there was no reason to keep it in, so I did cut that out. But for the most part, it's completely uncut. We got a lot done. I hope you guys enjoy. What's going on, guys? Rabbit here. Welcome back to Subnautica. And uh, I have literally no plans for today, if I'm being completely honest. I uh, kind of just felt like playing some Subnautica. And uh, so we're playing it now. That's about it. Welcome aboard, Captain. Not sure what we're going to do today. I do kind of want to expand the base a little. That is on my mind, but I don't know if that is uh, uh, something I've been to already and I was using it as a marker or not. Okay, but um, I am going to go to it because why not. Uploaded to PDA. Okay. So I guess we're gonna go there also. I guess that'll be the plan for today. We're gonna ignore the fact that that isn't completed yet. Water? Vital signs stabilizing. Let's uh go s s grab some fishies to launch and slurp. I don't think I'm going to edit this one very much, mostly because I'm tired and I want to get this up tomorrow. Um, so I'm only going to, I'm not going to edit this too much. So yeah. Welcome to an almost completely unedited episode. Let's cook some peepers. Make some water. That took a quite a while. There you go. Now we're maxed out. So let's uh, let's see. Which one do I want to go to? I have a feeling like we went to thirteen before. But, we're going to go again just to be safe. So we're going to do 12 and 13. How's your battery doing, a dear bud? Oh, we should be fine. Welcome aboard, Captain. Um, they are opposite sides of each other. Okay, let's go to 13 and then, and then back here to drop off whatever we find and then towards 12. We'll do these these things and then we'll probably work on the base a little. I just want to expand it. Um, I do want to know find where the uh, the moon pool fragments are. I would love to get the moon pool as soon as possible. Shut up. The moon pool is something that make my life so much easier. Oh shit 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 shit. Yeah, I do want to make the base not just like a storage area. For, like right now, it's basically just an area for me to throw everything. Cause I don't like having those little like floating lockers out in the water. They annoy me. So right now it's just like a storage area, but I do want to actually make it a base or so I don't have to keep it going back between it and the life pod. But that'll happen eventually, but not now. This is the little mushroom ghost ray area. I know they're called jelly rays, but the ghost rays sound so much better. What is? 
Modification. Ooh, we need this. I th oh, scanner's already in my inventory. Let's keep an eye out for the other pieces of that, because I'm going to need that if I want to upgrade my, uh, my Tingy, my Seamoth. I barely saw this. Power transmitter. Well, that was kind of boring. I don't know if that was useful or not, but it's still boring. I love the jelly rays, ghost rays, whatever, I don't care. So cool. Hey there, bud, uh, you look kind of stuck there. I. Integrating new PDA data. Spadefish? Oh, don't, you don't get to escape. Huh. Nothing really important here. Why are you screaming? God! Uh, let's listen to this, uh, PDA. Live pod launch sequence initiated. Entering planetary atmosphere. My creators, the cherishers and sustainers of worlds, give me this day my daily pleasures as I give to those who seek pleasures from me. External temperature approaching critical levels. Show me the path in life, truth, and love for mine is the power. I am the one. On and off and on again. In that imminent. Life is a game which the universe plays with itself. I am done playing as this bundle of flesh. Return me. Okay, then. He sounded like he was not okay in the head, if you ask me. Oh, <laughs> that hurt. Hmm. I was hoping we could find more of the modification station fragments here, but I'm not seeing anything. Another power transmitter. Wait, what is that? That's a creature egg. I'm severely disappointed. That's something, though. What is that? Moonpool fragment. Yay! Well, to answer that question, now we just need the modification station stuff, which I guess is in this area, so let's look around a little bit more and see if we can find it. What is... There we go. That's two. We just need to find one more. Hell yeah. That's it, isn't it? Oh! Damn! Okay! I'll take it! I'm not gonna turn that down. It's really useful. Cyclops Bridge Fragment. Two out of three. We gotta only need one more. I think we got the... What do we have for the... Blueprints. For the... The Cyclops. I know we don't have... The entire thing, but I know we have a lot of it. Yeah, with the Cyclops hole, so we just need two more engine and one more bridge. Dang. Okay. We get that. We'll be set. I don't know where to find the engine fragments. I don't even know where I found that one. The one I already have. But, I guess we'll find it eventually, hey? I 
I do have a list of all the locations for the blueprints, but I'm trying not to use it, you know? I kind of want to try and find them. But uh, if I have to, I will use the list to, to find them. That is the last of the modification station. We can get out of here. Well. Let's head back to base. This game is so pretty. I know I've said that like so many times already, but like, it just looks so good. You're a dick. That guy? He's a dick. Like, it's just so pretty. Where are you beautiful bastards at? There you are. Oh, wait, let's try something. Uh, I remember a couple of episodes ago, someone asked if uh, you could build on the back of reefbacks. And I am genuinely curious too, so we're about to find out. I'm starting to think you can't. I'm now severely disappointed. <laughs> Uh, that sucks. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. That kind of sucks. That'd be really cool, though. Make a base on a reef back, just float around. That'd be so cool, actually. Right, let's see what's going on here. This is Life Pod 6. I have a passenger on board. Coordinates attached. We've landed a kilometer from the crash site, but there's radiation in between us and the rendezvous. Request immediate assistance. Six out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to data bank. Hmm, okay. I'm actually really enjoying, uh... Really enjoying, like, exploring all these life pods, like, in the stories. I never really took time to do that in the past. Okay. Can a Seamoth fit under that? Um, I think it would, but that's a little bit close for comfort. What are you trying to attach to? Is... I don't know, if I'm being honest. <laughs> Let's grab some titanium. Welcome aboard we'll work on this a little bit. Lead, lithium... Do I really not have any titanium? Okay. I guess we gotta go grab some titanium. There should be just like scraps around here still. I haven't really... Harvest, harvested most of it. There, yeah, there you are. I know those little shits like it. Plenty. What is in that? What is that? I already have that. You don't need. Convert all of this salvage to titanium. I love it. I 
Did I really grab that much? I thought I grabbed more, to be honest. What do I need for this? Lubricant, lead, and titanium? I think I have literally all of that. Um, lead. If I don't have any loop. Hmm, okay. That's fine. That's not that hard to get. Yeah, we'll do the moon pool. Like, I was contemplating in my head if I really wanted to do the moon, moon pool right now. I need two of these, right? I hope I have enough titanium. Not sure, to be honest. Yep. Thought so. I'm not gonna lie, I can't remember. What is it you need for loop? You find clusters, okay. I couldn't remember if it was the cluster or the actual vine. Hmm. Thanks, mate. Haha. -ha. I stole your stuff. Might as well do both. More titanium. And the ingot. And like that, we have a moon pool. Did work. Did it work? It's attached. Yay! Now, let's grab our Seamoth. There we go. Oh, that was... Uh, that's awesome. And now, what do we need for the... After weeks without human contact, it is normal to experience psychological discomfort. Research indicates symptoms may be partly alleviated by adopting a pet or anthropomorphizing an inanimate object. I just remember that the modification station is not what I thought it was. That is for other things, not the, we need the vehicle modification thingy. Dang it. Okay. Um. We'll get that eventually. We'll get that eventually. Let's uh, let's do all the like an essentials so we can make this like into an, like an actual base. How about that? We need copper, not gold. Um, let's put the radio here, and then do I have table cor coral thingies? I do. Again, whoa, that was some weird lag. Um, fabricator. Let's slap it right. Hmm. Here. Losing power quickly. Need to get a some more uh, solar panels on the roof. How much quartz do we have? Enough to make a another solar panel. We'll add another one for now. I know it's not gonna help during the night, of course, but it's better than one. How about that? Okay. I am really satisfied with this. Is it charging my? Seamoth, is that why we're losing power?
It is! Okay. I didn't know that. All systems online. That was real that's really nice to know. Okay, let's uh let's go to this life button. Um that was a case of me just not paying attention. <laughs> okay, hi there. I'm not... I don't like you. You scare me. Because I don't know what you are and what you do. It's a thermal vent. What are these fuckers? I don't like this. I don't like this at all. No, 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 no. I want to fix you. I want you to be a max health if we're going down there. I don't know if these guys can hurt the sea moth. They definitely can hurt me. I don't know if they can hurt the sea moth though, so. I'm gonna be a little careful. Detecting volcanic activity and several unusual electromagnetic signatures in the region. Exercise caution while diving deeper. Fucking sand shark. Grab that. Integrating new and... PDA data. That. What did we get? Oh! Well, there you go! Let's leave! I don't want to be here anymore. Mm -mm. Let's play the. Uh, it's the medical bay, yeah. I'm uh, not really a doctor. I know that's what my ID says, but I never have been cheated the medical exams. What does a doctor these days need to know about manually resetting bones? When was the last time a top surgeon actually cut someone open? That's what the robots are for. Doctors these days read diagnoses off of computer readouts. For that, I'm perfectly qualified. But what good is it when I'm not connected to the main network? I'm bleeding. I've got glowing green pustules growing on my hands. I run a self-scan and it tells me I got skin irritation. The only thing I studied in medical school was how to lie convincingly. What the hell do I know about how to treat an alien disease? I think I'm actually going to die down here. And that, kids, is why you don't cheat on your exams. You wound up on a weird, mysterious alien planet. Like, almost 400 meters, like, 250 meters below sea level. Bleeding out. Okay, we're back. Let's, uh, go in here. We have a communication to listen to. Probably a new life pod. There we are. This is life pod four. We've landed close to the Aurora. Flotation device is active, but we've got some big old fish in the water with us, and I don't know how long we're gonna last. We're close to the crash site, so bring radiation protection. Four out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to data bank. Hmm. Fifty. Huh. Did we? That's cool, actually. So we have to actually find those life pods. That's actually really cool. Like it isn't just like, hey, oh yeah, here, go here. It actually is telling you like a general idea, and you have to find it. That's I really enjoy that. 
That's a nice change of pace. Um, I don't know what to do. I'm being honest. Um, I I really want to get uh stuff done, but like I really don't. Shut up! I think like lately, like I've been just kind of following the life pods. Which I definitely do want to do, like, all the life pods. Like, I definitely want to, but I don't want to just do those, like, every episode, you know what I mean? We've already. D I did not want to do that. We've already done two today, so. Go in! Fine, fine, fine. With your stupid cycling. Come on. Thank you. So, I'm not sure what to do. Um. I guess we can find something to do. Let's look through the habitat builder. Oh, this is useful. It's not yet. The bioreactor might be a good idea. Do we have the interior plant like this thing? Ooh, I know what we could do. We could go to the um or back to the Aurora and cut through this, the some of the doors since I have the laser cutter now. And while we're over there, we can go look for that life pod maybe. Yeah, there you go. Boom. See, I'm I I know what I'm doing. I have good ideas. Systems online. Okay, where's the Aurora? Ow! There she is. Okay, let's uh look at the um, the data bank for the this one. <coughs> oh, give me a sec. Origin prox approximately 150 meters northwest of Aurora's port midsection. So let's just go towards the Aurora, go towards like the middle area. We need to go north. Ooh. Northwest. I don't know which way that is, but I think we can make the compass actually. I think we got the blueprint for that. I can't remember when. I wanted the life pause. So uh, let's go try to find that. Let's see if we can make that. That would make our life significantly easier. Compass. Equipment. There we go. Copper wire and a wiring kit. We need silver, don't we? Two silver. Two copper. Ooh, please tell me I have the silver. I think that's probably. No. Huh. How about you shut up, huh? Yeah, I don't... What is Northwest? Northwest. You would think all these, like, advanced submarines would just come with... a compass, you know what I mean? Yeah, whatever. Um... 150 meters northwest. It's at sea level. Like it is it is floating. You think it could be on one of the reef backs? Is that possible? Because I think that, I personally think that if it was at sea level, it would be pretty easy to see just like floating on the water, but if it's on a le reef back, it could go above and below sea level. That scannable. You're, you're, you're not nice. You know that? You're a dick. That's, that's it. That's all I have to say to you. You're a dick.
What is that? That looks like Cyclops bridge fragment. Boom. Now we just need the engine fragments, I'm pretty sure. And then we'll have the the Cyclops. And we can work on that. That is nice. Is what is. I think that will finish the grab trap for us. Let's look around here. Giant coral tubes. Hmm. Sea glide? Have, of course. I don't really expect to find anything useful here, if I'm being honest. But might as well check it out anyway. Oh, for sure. Take it. So where is the entrance here? Air tool. There you go. Just a grab trap? Really? That's kind of disappointing. Oh, wait. What do we got here, eh? Just... This is gonna be close, actually. Oh, I wasn't paying attention to the oxygen. Okay. I didn't like that. I was not paying attention to the oxygen at all. We got the stasis rifle, stasis rifle out of that. Honestly, don't know how helpful that's gonna be if I'm being honest. Hmm. I don't know. Explore a little bit more around the roar. Plenty of scrap here. That is a Cyclops engine piece. I know it. Ooh. If we can find those here, we might be able to find the third one today. Holy sh I, that was weird. I'm kind of scared to get the Cyclops now, to be honest. Like, if I can barely drive this, like, how am I gonna drive the Cyclops? The, the, the Reaper can't spawn over here, right? Right? Like, I thought he's only on like the other side of the ship, right? Oh my god. Oh my god. I heard the fucking Oh god. I heard this, you know, the you know, the the fucking screaming, you know. But I didn't know he could spawn over there. Is there multiple of them? Oh my god. Oh, I got fucking goosebumps. That scared the shit out of me. Oh my god. God! Oh, I want to go back. <laughs> I want to see what's over there. If I could find, I just gotta be careful. I didn't see him last time. I didn't think he would be here. What is that? I 
suddenly don't want to be here. Where did he come from? You know, screw this. Screw it. Nope. That. What is that? What is that? What is that? What is? Depression. Nope. I don't want to be here anymore. I'm out. Peace. Fuck that. I kind of need to go back to base and get some water. Yeah, that'll be a good idea. Let's do that. Oh my god. I. So, is there two of them or does he. Can, can he spawn on multiple signs? Like, you know, depending on where you go. That's a that's my question. Also, can he attack the the cyclops? Out of curiosity, probably can. Wouldn't be surprised, but curious. That was stressful. Like, genuinely, like... That scared the crap out of me. Come here, boomerang. Hoverfish. I actually kinda wanna hoverfish as a pet. Like, look how cool they are. Yeah, I'm gonna take you, but I'm not gonna eat you. I think we need quartz for glass to make a aquarium. So while we're out, why not get that? I wouldn't mind getting a pet fishy fishy boyo, you know what I mean? I think the hoverfish are probably my favorite. They're so cool. At least out of the fish we can put in an aquarium. But if I could, I'd probably put the, the ghost ray. I know it's jelly ray, but ghost ray. There we are. Heck off. I know what I know what you are, and I don't like you. Oh wait, no, I thought those I thought it was a boom fish yelling at me. Well damn, is it that bad? Oh my god. Oh my god. Welcome Stop lagging! It's frozen! Water! Oh my god. Here, play that. Aurora, we're approaching the planet now. We have a landing site for you that's... Well, it's better than the alternatives. We've sent you the coordinates. It'll take us a couple of days to align our orbit. We should be able to establish direct contact with you during that time. Then we're coming in to get you. Cross your fingers, the weather holds. Don't leave us waiting. Sunbeam out. Seek fluid intake. Shut up! I get it! Vital signs stabilizing. God damn! That was not nice. I didn't enjoy that. Well, Sunbeam's gonna be here soon. That's. That's fun. <laughs> um. Habitat Builder. Um. Aquarium. Boom. Let's put even. Let's not talk about it, okay? Okay, we we didn't name him, so we weren't attached to him. He was still technically just food. I'm sure we can get you. It'd be cool to have as a pet. I want a pet fishy though. I want a hover fish. We have multiple. Let's grab a boomerang. Got a couple boomerangs because I still kind of need some food. Um, let's grab some, a peeper and a Gary fish.
landing site, eh? Guess we should go over there. I'm a tools. I do not need a scanner. I need not that. Let's put the Gary Fish in there, the boomerang, and the peeper. Look at my boyos! I'm happy. Okay. I'm satisfied. Let's uh. Let's slap the lube in here real quick, and then let's grab a med kit. Use one of the med kits. Okay. And then let's go back to the Aurora. And this time, maybe not say hi to a uh, friendly neighborhood Leviathan. We'll probably um, do the... Uh, Where's the Aurora? There she is. We will probably do the um, Sunbeam stuff next episode. So, look forward to that. This episode, though, we're just gonna go explore the uh, Aurora again to get through all like the cut doors and stuff. And then I think when we get back from that, we'll end it. I don't know how long this episode is, but I think it's relatively short compared to the others. I don't think it's nearly as scuffed as the last one, though. The last one was, uh, not my proudest. For some reason, I feel like Northwest is this way. I have no, like, reasoning. Found it! I f knew it. Huh. Interesting. But it's still floating. New blueprint acquired. It's the aid kit, I'll take it. And uh, PDA. To any Altera crew. Landed in area of significant alien activity. Counted predators in the Leviathan class highly aggressive. Spectroscope scanner assigned species designator Reaper. One specimen attempted to swallow the life pod, doing extensive damage in the process. Only viable option is to make for the safety of the Aurora crash site. I have retrieved a data box with the creature decoy and enough resources to fabricate a couple of them. The swim's longer than the decoy lifetime, but it should just be enough to keep them busy. If you don't find me on board the ship, presume I miscalculated. Okay, back into this hellhole. I did not enjoy my last visit here. It's scary as fuck. Like the idea behind this game, it just gives me chills. <laughs> Good job, no. I don't remember how we got up last time, if I'm being honest. Was it? I don't think it was this way. I think it was over here. Yep, right here. Okay. Ow. Thought about the fire soon, just I didn't even think about it. Let's grab you. So 
So, um, I wasn't expecting to get a genuine scare out of this game for me. A genuine scare out of me from this game. Because, you know, I kind of know, like, lore-wise, most things. But, I, even though I know that the, um, Leviathan, you know, the Reaper exists, doesn't mean he can't scare the absolute shit out of me. It really... That, I, I didn't know. Like, I just didn't know that it spawned back there. That was the problem. Hey, Rory, you're looking, uh, as good as ever. These respawn? Okay. I don't know if the I don't think they do. I may have missed that last time. Let's get through here. Where was the laser cutting area? It was, yeah, there it is. It's over there. Okay. Come on. There we go. What? Put it in there. Thank you. That animation's pretty cool. Integrating new PDA data. Auxiliary mission orders. Mission search and rescue crew of the Mongolian vessel Degasi. So they were actually looking for the the uh, the crew that was on a. Uh, I reckon my goal ain't cheap. Okay. So the yeah, uh, yeah, this was a lot. Okay. Okay, so they were actually planning on looking for them here. Like so was this planet not integrating new PDA data. The goal of uh, come on. <sighs> Brain work. Was this not the goal? Like, were they not planning on uh, landing here? Hmm. Battery? There's also a code there, so... I'm guessing we're gonna need that soon. Anything else? I don't think so. That was some nice lag. I'm, it's weird I'm getting all these like weird frame frame drops. Air tool now. Let's not touch the fire. Fire burns you, and it's not nice. Oh wait, is this the is this the prawn soup? Eh? Picking up a faint black box signature originating on the other side of the hull breach in this room. Can I get to that? Yeah, I can. Is there four pieces of the front suit in here? Oh, I didn't want to fall down here. Get out. Come on. There we go. Okay. I wonder if we extinguish that, can we scan it? Out of curiosity. Let's try. Yes, you can. That was a total guess. New oh, a power cell? Okay, I'll take it. Huh? Huh? No. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Okay, whatever. Fine. Fine. Huh? Back off. Huh? Can we not go up? Huh? 
We have to be able to go up, can't we? Right? Come on. Okay, whatever, fine. Fine. Heck off. We'll go down here. I don't know if there's anything useful down here. Or if it's just a death death trap. Definitely gonna look. The flashlight? Where does this go? Data terminal? The Aurora Black Box? New PDA data. Okay, we'll look at that in a second. Hot battery. Laser cutter. Once we get out uh, where there's oxygen, I'll uh, I'll read it. Data. Hmm. Lab access. I'm guessing it's six four eight three. Six four eight three. Still large sample flask. Take it, why not? Non-functional, non-functional. I don't care, I'll take it, man. Decoration. Data terminal. Integrating new PDA data. Data bank corruption was detected on your PDA. Your technology blueprints have been updated. Oxygen. Lab access. Come by cabin number one, codes one. Okay, so cabin number one we have the code for. What is the other one? We got another one. What oh, we can learn from the hive mind of Strader. A hive mind? That's cool. I'm not gonna read this, because to be honest, it's not story, it's just kind of like, you know, lore stuff. Like, outside lore, not in-game. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know, it doesn't really... I don't know, I don't want to read it, is basically what I'm trying to say. It's a lot of words. Um, this is a problem. I can't get out here. Meaning, I have to find another way out. Because I don't remember, I can't remember correctly, the other way was a one way street, right? Oh, wait. No, we would have needed it. Was this not a one way street? I can't remember. No, it wasn't. Let's head back. So, there has to be another place we can go through these tunnels, huh? There has to be. Hmm. Another fire extinguisher?
Maybe not. Seek fluid intake. Shut up. Shut up. Hmm. I don't know how to get to the cabin area. I remember seeing... That's the crew quarters up there, right? We need the propulsion cannon, right? So we can pick these up and move them out of the way. God damn it. I wanna see. Ah, yes, yes. I'm glad I tried. I almost didn't try to do that. Really glad I did now. Vital signs stabilizing. Power. Hell yeah, dude. You shrimp block. Water. Water. Food. Food. I won't deny it. What am I scanning? Table. Was this like a kitchen area? Looks like it. Bending machine! New blueprint acquired. Let me get snacks. Aw, oh, I tried. Huh? What? You gotta be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me right now. Oh my god. What did I lose here? There was something there. What did I lose there? Ah. Oh. This is Life Pod 7. Coordinates attached. Pod is structurally sound, but the fabricators bust. Requesting assistance. Seven out. Signal coordinates corrupted. Approximate transmission origin recorded to date to bank. I don't even want to go back. Like, I gotta go back. <sighs> okay. I think I'm gonna end the episode here. Um. I don't know if you can get your stuff back, but frankly, I don't care. I really don't want to go back there. And plus, I'm gonna need to do it anyways at the beginning of the next episode because that is all I'm going to do for today. That was a really bad note to end it off on, to be honest. I'm kind of kind of mad. I'm kind of mad at myself because I wasn't paying attention to my health. God damn it. That would have been fine. Ugh, whatever. Okay. Hope you guys enjoyed the episode today. I know, like I said, I'm not going to really edit this too much because I want to get up tomorrow. And it is... 11.49, and I still have to edit it and make a thumbnail. So, um, 11.49 p.m., by the way. Uh, so, yeah. Um, hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.